do you want to migrate to Australia without paying any money, like without spending, like someone else covering your traveling expenses? It is doable. People are doing it. But there are a certain way you got to do this, okay? So, if you want to hear more about migrating to Australia, jabbering to Australia, moving to Australia without paying much money from your pocket, please stay tuned. Let's dig in. everyone welcome to my channel jenkenny's creation where we keep it real go and verify my name is jane and i live in australia welcome and for my subscribers thank you you guys rock and if you are new in this channel please do subscribe to my channel and become a member of this beautiful family where we keep it real and please can everyone just love my video like like my video click the like button and love it all right let's talk about this many people want to migrate to australia some people are going the wrong way i know you might not have the money to pay for your visa or flight ticket or so many other things and you want someone else to cover your bills there is something you have to do this pathway is not gonna be easy i'm not gonna lie to you i'm not going to tell you do this do this voila someone will sponsor you no it is hard but you know what people are doing it and if you've made up your mind that this is the pathway you want to go then you should be totally out for it okay so you don't jump from this to that yes it is true that you can migrate to australia without you paying for it but how do you do this there are only two ways this can be possible the first option would be if you want to go through study route then you look for full funded scholarship i have shared so many scholarship in this channel i've even shared the one from australian government okay where they even pay you and pay for your flight ticket and everything and i also shared for the one from new zealand government new zealand government also i've shared that one where they will also cover everything you are feeding your flight ticket your living allowance and so many of them so if you choose to go through this pathway study route and you don't want to pay anything then you can look for full funded scholarship now another way again where your study can be subsidized is by looking for schools that will give you grants and scholarships i will share more in this channel okay look out for them there are so many schools in australia i am telling you i am telling you if you are studying in australia and you're an international student you don't have at least one grant or scholarship you should examine yourself or maybe you should change school <laughs> But what I'm telling you is this, there's so many grants and scholarship in Australian schools for international students. So you don't tell me because they're studying this course or that course. When there are a lot, the possibility of you getting at least one is what? High. You have a high probability of getting at least one. So there are so many schools in Australia that can give you grants and scholarship. Okay. So if you want to go study route and you don't have enough money, but first of all, you need to cover your first tuition. And sometimes they give you 50%. And sometimes they give you fully funded for your first tuition. Then you need to cover the other one. But once you come in, scout for scholarship and grant in from your school website. Okay. Another thing is that even if you are not going to study now, please start searching for scholarship and grant. Maybe you want to travel uh, to Australia in 2024, 2025. You could get yourself acquainted with all this information. Okay. It helps. It makes you get prepared, very well prepared, like loaded with information. All right. So that's for people that want to go for study. It is doable that your study can be covered. All right. Now, another pathway another route that you can actually carry your bag they work out they go like you carry your bag with your family and move over to australia is through what work visa that reminds me many of you will chat me and tell me how much is work visa hey jane kenny's i don't give work visa and people 
are duping you. Hey. If you are in this channel and someone is still duping you in this 2023, you should examine yourself. I have told you guys about Visa 482 and the only way you can get it is by finding a job and getting a sponsor. In Australia, there is nothing like overseas agency recruiting from third world country. There is nothing like that because you have to go through a system whereby your qualification and experience has to be examined, has to be assessed. How would they assess you? Tell me. It's okay for them to get a UK citizen because they know that UK system, Canada system, USA system is okay. They can, do you understand? There's a way they can assess this thing and get the information. I'm talking about only the citizens of these countries. Okay. If you are still a migrant using a temporary resident visa in these countries, it will be hard. Okay. Unless you studied like in New Zealand, it's okay. They will just, it's, it's the same thing. Like they are brothers and sisters. Okay. So if you want to go through work visa, whereby your employer will cover the bill for you and your family, because it's going to be a family visa. You know what you do. You go look for job. It's not going to be easy. Anyone telling you it's going to be easy is a lie. You know me. In this channel, we'll keep it real, like authentic, go and verify. If anyone is telling you that you will be in Nigeria, be in Ghana, be in Bangladesh, be in India, be anywhere and easily get a job in Australia, the person did lie. It is a lie. But you know one thing I want to tell you is this. People from your village are doing it. People from your country are doing it. And if you are well determined to do it, you will not give up and you will achieve it. Don't go and search for one job and apply for 10 jobs and say you are okay, that you are tired. You have not started. Even the behold, you have not started. Eh? You are trying to start. Another thing I want to tell you is this. Please, if you are looking for a job, I have made so many videos about looking for job in Australia. We have job websites, so many of them. We have Seek Australia, Indeed Australia, Jora Australia, and go to Google as well. Search. Google will give you so many links. Do not use one CV for all your application. Each job you found, please tell all your CV. Go and update your CV to suit that job. It might even be one job title, but the employer want people with certain skills and personality. Be co, go back. Please go back and edit your CV to match what the employer needs. Uh -huh. Again, some of you that are doing application and you do in your application, you said you don't have experience and you're applying. How can you do such a thing and you're hoping the employer will call you? If you don't have experience and it's something that you can achieve within six months, be smart enough to know what to write there. And if you think you have a high chance of doing it, why not go and look for experience? Know what it's all about so that when they call you for interview, you'll be able to answer questions. This thing warrant some kind of smartness there. It's not the most intelligent that get these things. It has to do with smartness, okay? Mm-hmm. Yes. So this is life. No one see the mba, please. Make provision for editing your CVs, okay? Tell all it according to what the employer wants for a particular job. Give them what they want. Give it to them. Eh? And please be ready. And any job you apply for in Australia and you do not receive a confirmation email, that job did not go through. Go back and redo it. That is 100% sure that you must get acknowledgement. The same thing is applicable to grants and scholarship. Any application, there must be a confirmation email. If you don't receive it, go back and redo it. There is something you didn't do well. Okay, so when you are looking for job, there is nothing so special about Australian CV. But sometimes in this channel, I'm going to show you example of CVs. Make your CV juicy. I know some of you will ask me about this CV and I am promising now that we're going to go through Australian CV sometime in this channel.
okay so you have an idea there is something also called cover letter where you have to explain yourself how you meet up with the requirements why they should employ you give a little bit of history about your background don't come and tell them how many children you have or how many girlfriends you've had they don't want to hear that okay but what i am telling you my wonderful community members is that if you really want it don't give up keep scouting keep searching for employer i remember we say you can slide to their dm like you can send a company a letter telling them that you know they are looking for locals but see what i got and i am happy to go through the migration process with you i am willing okay and if you can offer whatever way you can help them with the migration process table it there is no harm in shooting you a shot there are only two things that will come out of it yes or no it doesn't hurt okay try all right so what i'm telling you today is that people are being duped every day in millions of naira in millions of your country currency in thousands of dollars hard currency people are being duped you see this a 482 is a work visa the employer will sponsor you do you know how much the employer will pay to sponsor you is huge okay now i'm telling you this because when they are duping you please ask them question ask them which employer ask them where is your employment contract letter of employment go and search this employer if they are in australia you will see in their website their email address send them email and confirm your employment confirm that employment you are human being you have data you need to tackle these scammers one after the other you have the brain to tackle them but the problem is that you're overwhelmed with this fake visa and something that whatever they tell you you accept who is my employer okay they have employed me show me my contract they will give you a fake or real one go online search for this company check if they are really australian company send them email they have email in there the scammer will not go to a real company's email and change their email address instead they will create their own website and you know when you see a fake website you will know okay because i know you are smart you need to use your smartness okay so in today's video i just want to tell you yes it is possible for you to migrate to australia without paying any money even moving with your family there are only two ways get a full funded scholarship or you can what reduce the cost of your studies by looking for 50 percent or 60 percent scholarship or so many grants when you gather so many grants from your school it will cover your fees now another route is for you getting a job which is also possible get a job the employer will sponsor you but please stop falling victim scammers are everywhere visa 482 is the real source of their scamming game these days you need to be careful they are promising you something they don't have be smart about it okay yes you can come to australia yes you can come to aussie without having to pay through your nose okay so i want to tell you that australia is a beautiful country once you come in here you go there run for work you go work tire okay we have beautiful weather we have beautiful system we still enjoy community spirit here okay we have regard for each other we respect each other people still frown at something that is bad inhuman behavior and so on okay we still correct people we still say people are gorgeous we still commend people we are happy people here and please if you ever want to come to australia do not give up it is real people are doing it okay that brings us to the end of this video and if you haven't subscribed to this channel for more to come please hit the subscription button and become a member of this wonderful family where we keep it real and until i see you in my next video thank you bye